Yo guys, what is up? Welcome to another vlog. So if you guys can't already tell, we're outside in our garden and this place looks dead as hell. Like, I'm just gonna be straight out honest. I don't know what happened. Our garden looks awful. Like all the grass is dying. We do feed it. There's literally automatic sprinklers, but that's besides the point guys. Anyways, today we actually have a little challenge for you guys. So, I've seen this challenge going around eating black ice cream. What? <laughs> you, you didn't tell me about it. Yeah, I didn't tell you. Basically, there's these like unique ice cream flavors. And I was like, you know what? Let me buy some. So, I couldn't find black ice cream, but, but I, found found, <laughs> I found purple, purple. ice cream oh my God. and black yogurt. That is so cool. Look at the name of the ice cream. Ube. 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 That mean? Oob. <laughs> I don't know what you mean. We also have black yogurt, which is pretty much black ice oh, cream. So me. let's try these out, guys. How do you know it's black? It looks black on the box. I mean, it's got a color, <laughs> damn it. Have you ever seen that? Like, it says vanilla on it, Mohammed. It does? Yeah. All right, let's check this out, guys. How? I've never seen. Like, if this yogurt. is not black, I'm getting a refund. Are you sure about Why is it black on the box then if it's not going to be black inside? It could be any color container. It doesn't mean it inside. Alright, if this is not black, I'm going to be so disappointed. <laughs> we don't know. Yogurt does not come in like. Actually, this was quite misleading. There's like a. a Okay, I'm, I'm suing that brand. I'm suing you guys. I'm suing you guys. I'm coming after you. So we're completely changing the name of this video, guys. We're doing purple ice cream. We completely failed on that black one. But yeah, if this is not purple, I'm literally going to kill myself. All right, moment of truth, guys. If this is not purple, That is nice. I can't smell anything. You can't smell anything? It has to have some sort of right? smell. Okay, what do we do next? Okay, so we're gonna do the purple ice cream taste test. Your phone is ringing. Oh, man. We're gonna take a nice big scoop of that purple ice cream. Okay. I hope it tastes nice. If it doesn't, that was like kind of pointless. Whoa, do you realize the color of the ice cream? There you go. It looks so crazy. Moment of truth, let's see how this tastes. As my sister said, Can it I doesn't right smell quick? like anything. Okay, three, two, one, let's do this. What is this? I don't know what this is. It tastes like wood. It doesn't taste it like bad, wood. but it doesn't really have a taste. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell is this? What is this? It actually tastes like wood. You are completely, it tastes like grass and wood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm never eating grass, so I don't know. What the hell? It's interesting. It's different. It's interesting to say that. I didn't know purple tastes like that. It literally doesn't have any taste I that I could this. refer I'm to. Sorry, I need to Google what this is. I have no idea what we're tasting, guys. Okay, this is probably really bad for the Did inside of my body. Like a normal shop, right? Yeah, it was a normal shop. Okay. It was a <laughs> it's made from purple yam. It's a species of what? Wait. Species? <gasps> what is that? What? No, 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 no. That cannot be what I thought it is. It's, oh, it's a vegetable, guys. It's a vegetable. So this is good for me? Yeah. <laughs> that's what it looks like. Okay, well, that's the ice cream yeah. we're having, guys. Purple yam. Yo. Hey, look at my tongue, look at my tongue. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, actually not a bad start to a day. I like this challenge, that was interesting. It's a root vegetable. A root vegetable. Like this, and then... Oh, okay, don't show me that. No, That's disgusting. No, 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 no get no, the hell no, out no, of no, here. No, 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 listen, when they cut it in the middle, it looks like purple. That literally just looked like poop. <laughs> <laughs> It looked like shit on a leaf. It's a root. What do you expect? Roots are all the same shape. Look. Anyways, bon appetit, guys. Um, yeah, it's okay. It's okay. Not yeah, that. Yeah. See, like we got proper images. There, there you go. go. That it, this came from a leaf. I knew it was grass. It's actually when the more you eat it, the more delicious it gets. You think? Yeah. We did tell you that this matches the car. Yeah. Tell me if I'm wrong. Uh, 
Oh, okay, no. our phone's ringing again. <laughs> We've literally been contacting our cooler service the whole day, like you know, our telephone service. And every time they've called us, we miss the call, which is really bad. Anyways, this is melting onto my hand, guys. I'm gonna go inside, enjoy the rest of my ice cream. But I had to come outside just to get a picture with this car and the ice cream. It, it's okay, it's okay. I'm actually kind of getting used to it now. What just happened? Okay, so basically I had a call from like the post office. And oh, was it the post office? I thought it was your telephone provider. No, it's not. It was the post office and they were asking, they said there's a shipment that arrived. <laughs> I was like, okay, and it didn't have, apparently didn't have the PO box. No, but the person who sent it didn't put the full address. So they just put a uh, name. Um, yeah. And I was like, okay, so what do I need? And then they're like, wait, are you Lana from Moblox? And I was like, <laughs> <laughs> I was like, yeah. Oh my. I was like, oh my god, how do they recognize this? <laughs> But yeah, they said send regards to Mo and Mommy Mo. Oh, yalla yalla. Yalla yalla. <laughs> That's like oh, the you. funniest thing, guys. You know, I know it's like, I was like, how did they know? How did they know? <laughs> I'm sure there's like so hundreds shy. of longings. <laughs> yeah. The thing is, guys, it's the most no, so. I love the end when they said yalla yalla. <laughs> That's the best. Like, it's so funny when you call somebody and they actually recognize you from yeah. the phone. You're like. The moment she said. Are you Lana from? I was like, she caught me. Oh. She caught me. She caught me. Oh, but so sweet. I love you guys. She's a big fan. So shout out to you. Shout out to you from the post office. What was her name? Uh, we'll keep that confidential. No, we'll actually, that I don't even know. Love you so much. Anyways, let's continue the rest of the day, guys. Purple ice cream was purple. I mean, and that's all I could say. No smell, no taste. It tasted. No, it's like one of those tastes that you keep going, you keep going. You, you just, yeah, you have to it. keep on tasting it's it, you like, know? You know some hobbies, like you just start in the beginning, it's hard, but then you like like it more and more. You just compared ice cream to a hobby. What the hell are you <laughs> on about? Right now, I'm actually in my room, guys, and I just have to say I'm sorry for the messiness. I, I just, I hate cleaning, guys. But I'm actually heading out because I want to buy myself like a shoe cabinet because if you guys don't know already I've been buying a couple of shoes over the past couple of weeks And I don't really have anywhere to put them except my cabinet And I'm saying that because I actually got so many comments saying Mo went and returned his shoes because if you guys didn't know like on the first day when the Jordan store opened here, yeah, I bought a couple of shoes and a lot of people said I went and returned them straight away. That's not the case, guys. It's actually all in my closet, like at the top, but I just don't know where to put them. So it's just never in the vlogs. Like, I I'm not gonna vlog me showing you the top of my cabinet. So we're gonna go out, try and find like a cool little display so I can actually put them out instead of just leaving them there because it's kind of boring, like it's boring being at the top of my cabinet and that way we can see all of the shoes. You know what I've realized? You guys have not heard my car for a while, listen up. I just want to let you know, this car has not lost its power, guys. We just made it over to Ikea, guys. And my mom said I should get something like this, where it's like a proper cabinet where you put your shoes in. But I don't know, man. All the sneaker channels that I watch, they just have those, like, plastic containers. This seems more like a girl's closet, you know? Like, it looks like a proper setup. Why is it always that there's babies crying in Ikea? I swear, I've never come to this place without hearing babies cry. Anyways, still looking around, haven't found too much. I found, <laughs> you hear that? I found a couple of cabinets. My mom wants me to get something like this, like a proper cabinet, but I don't know. Like, I just want it to look cool. So, I'm gonna keep looking around, see what I can find. God damn, these babies are so loud. You guys know what the funniest thing is about this place? They name, they literally put names on their furniture. What the hell, who the hell is Alex? <laughs> God damn. <laughs> okay guys, so check it out. I found a bunch of storage containers. I was gonna get this, but now that I think about it, I don't think it'll look good. Like the ones I wanted online, they're like bigger first of all, and they have like a flap, so you don't need to like take them out from under each other. The flap just opens and you can pull the shoes out. So I'm just gonna wait to find the proper ones. We were also looking at these things. Look at these, they're like these shoe shelves that they have over here, these plastic ones, but 
they just don't look good enough. They don't look good enough, guys. I want something that looks really, really nice. Okay, whenever I see cool things like this, I just love to play with them, guys. Whoa, <laughs> look at that. Hello. Well, that was another failed day, guys, over here. Actually, one thing I want to check before we leave is if they've stocked up on the bean bags. Last time I came, they didn't have anything in stock. So, let's go check the warehouse. Moment of truth, guys. Let's see. Do they have the bean bags? Wait, what the hell? They've completely removed them. They have no bean bags. Like, okay, they have these, but these are not the circular ones. These are like these big bean bags. He's gonna kill somebody. He's gonna kill somebody. <laughs> anyway, I used to do that as a kid all the time. I used to run and jump onto the car. Oh my, okay, okay. I <laughs> oh my god, that kid is literally gonna kill somebody. Anyways, the kid is still going. Although we didn't buy anything, guys, the best part about IKEA is their $2 hot dogs. Literally $2, you get a hot dog and a drink. That's the best two dollars I ever spent. Never forget guys, it isn't a hot dog without some ketchup. A lot of ketchup. A lot of ketchup. Okay, um, I think I'll go for a Fanta. This literally cost me two dollars. I'm happy. Let's go eat. You won't even believe it guys. It was so busy in Ikea. So busy. We couldn't even sit down to eat. We've literally just taken our food out. We're gonna try and get into either Starbucks or Costa Coffee and just sneak the food in. We're gonna, obviously we're gonna buy like a coffee or something, but we're gonna try and eat our hot dogs there. That's what you call life hacks, guys. If you, if you can't find seats in a restaurant, do a takeaway and eat it somewhere else where there is seats, okay? If you get caught, it's not my problem, guys. I don't care, like, I'm just saying what I do, okay? Oh my God, okay. Yo, we completely failed, guys. They've made it a little storage place. Ah, oh, it's closed? No, no, inside. Ah, <laughs> ah, oh, oh, renovation. Okay, thank you. Look at our luck. So, if you guys don't know how this place used to work, this whole section is supposed to be Costa Coffee, but they're doing renovation, so what they've done is put like a little stand outside it. There's always a plan B, guys. You can just bring the food in your car and eat here. When you're hungry, you just have to make do with what you can get, guys. That is really nice. I don't know if it's me being a guy or this is just weird, but I don't understand what type of fashion this is, guys. The girl does not have an eyebrow. What the hell is that? Okay. Just call me unfashionable or whatever. I don't get what type of artistic vision people have when they have no eyebrow in a photo. God, it looks, in my opinion, freaky. Let alone putting that as an advertisement for something. I don't know, maybe it's me, I'm a guy. I don't understand girl language, to be honest. Check this place out, guys. They've got like a camel statue and a person holding it. That is really cool. <laughs> I saw somebody taking a photo, I was like, wait, they have a camel indoors? And I realized it's like a statue. We finally found the exit, guys. And the reason we're going out over here, they've got like a, a lake type thing going on. Mommy, are you sure that's a door? Oh yeah, I don't think that's a door, mommy. I think this is the door. But yeah, guys, outside, <laughs> outside here, they've got like water. And you know what's really cool? One of my friends, they owned a yacht here. So when we would come, every weekend here we would go on their yacht and play playstation okay mommy i'm sure this is the wrong exit no yes where are the yachts there should be a yacht parking we're supposed to be over there on that side i don't know if we're in the right place or they've changed it yo okay look at this what that is so cool they've got like a little what do you call that an ice cream sundae is that, is that what you call vegan? Yes, <laughs> this is for vegan people that like ice cream, guys. What the hell is this? What? <laughs> this is a 7D cinema. Are we allowed to be in here? Mommy, I don't think we're allowed to be in here. Okay, I'm, I'm leaving, guys. What the hell is this? A 7D June cinema. I'm pretty sure if there's nobody in here, we're not supposed to be in here. Moral of the story is check online before you come somewhere. We drove half an hour. The only thing I had was a hot dog here. Just a half an hour drive for a $2 hot dog. Okay, we just found the coolest place to put my shoes, guys. 
You thought see-through boxes was cool? Look at this. Oh my god. This is what a car shoe storage place looks like. God damn. Wow. Oh my god. Yeah, we need to buy a car for my shoes, guys. It literally even has a number plate on it that says 1991. Okay, I really, really want myself a milkshake, guys. I can't lie. We had this free voucher at Hagen Daz. We walked around for like 25 minutes trying to find it and we still couldn't find it so you know what I'm just gonna go buy myself a milkshake I swear every person we all said it's all the way at the end of the mall it's always at the end I was like we kept on walking around and we couldn't find it so we just called it quits quickly went to get my milkshake let's see how this tastes guys that tastes nice I want to take this milkshake where my mom's having her tea but I'm not sure if they'll let me so I reckon if I put it in my pocket, which is gonna be a hard task because it's a big milkshake, I think they'll let me in. Okay. <laughs> All right. So that is what you call a milkshake in your pocket, guys. Mummy Mo's distracted her, guys. Maybe I can go in. I got my milkshake smuggled inside here. Oh yeah. This is how you know it's late right now, guys. When they turn off the water for this fountain, that means bye bye, go home, good night. We don't want you in the mall anymore. I don't know why, I love looking at like property development, guys. Look, oh my god. Oh, right now we're in the mountain. streets of Dubai, guys. <laughs> this is like drone mountain. footage right here. Oh my god. I'm sorry, guys. I literally just spotted a beautiful car in the parking and I had to stop. Look at this. This is a no ordinary Huracan. This has got the lights with the eyes you know the eye lights that's crazy okay i think i can go home now i knew i was gonna spot a really cool car today and there it is mommy you saw that yeah <laughs> what's happened i love my mom's delayed response i was like mommy you saw that yeah 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 definitely five minutes later yeah we are now home and I thought I'd wrap up today's vlog by showing you a sneak peek of my sister's new video. Mommy, the reason I'm actually showing you this guys because for the longest time ever you guys said record Lana doing a painting and time lapses. And so I did it. we did it. We did it. I'm actually it's I might that, just it's not easy by the way. It took a long time. It's not easy. Yeah, you'll see how much like fast like, forwarding how it many took layers and paint I put on. Oh my god. Okay. The the best part about this you video see a transformation <laughs> of me going through like four Blonde, five different brunette, hair colors. <laughs> all with one painting, guys. She changed her hair color four times while this painting was you going see, on. You know, I put it every time I got a new hair color, I'm like, yeah, I got a new hair color and then the next lap a new hair color. That's, that's ridiculous. I went through so many hair colors in this video. By the way, shout out to Lana Rose. <laughs> she wanted a shout out, so her link is in the description. We don't give free shout outs around here, Wait, but because play? she is my sister, fine. There you go. Shout out to Lana Rose. Out. <laughs> All right, let's watch this. If this is bad, I'm unsubscribing from your channel. Let's go. Play the damn video. Whoa. Wow. That's actually really cool. Oh, there's blonde Lana, guys. So this video yeah. started about a year ago. Next one. You can see the next hair color come up. One second. It's gonna come when I start coloring the... Okay, okay, not bad. Wait, this is still blonde. It's still you're gonna blonde. See it. You're gonna see it. Come here. And the next hair color... No! Oh! Damn! <laughs> she changed that quick! <laughs> come on, the next one we're gonna see. Hey! Third hair color! God damn! <laughs> and that is where the video wraps up. <laughs> you know, there was a couple More. of bloopers. I wasn't sure about putting it in because like I felt the video was as like long like as possible. So I just thought I'll cut it short. I don't know whether I should put it in your vlog. What is so. it? Hold on. What'd you do? No, like I was trying to introduce the video, video, um, sorry, I was gonna like wrap it up and say, yo, this is my painting in the end. 
and I just couldn't get it right. Every time I spoke, it just came out wrong. Okay, let's hear it. Let's so, hear it. So, wait, one second. We're going to open iMovie. My yeah, guys, is glitching out. If, so, if you second. didn't know, my sister spasticated at wrapping up vlogs. She's like, I kept saying it over and over. It kept coming <laughs> Um, oh man. This is the fun, um, Shout out to Lana Rose. There you go, guys. If you don't, if you don't already know her, she's somebody that's in the vlogs already. <laughs> so yeah, go check her her makeup and the art channel now. It's kind of now there's a new topic, something interesting going on. So maybe we can expect more stuff to come. Yeah, Mommy, Mo Mommy Mo's channel. There's no shoutouts for that, guys. Uh, there's, that, there's no shoutouts. Mo Mommy Mo, ne never. Sorry. What's Mommy Mo's channel about? Uh, she never In has future. one. In the future, she's there's she's a planning. Cooking channel. Yeah, that, that cooking. That. The cooking channel was a 50/50 ownership between. Oh. <laughs> it's called cooking with Mo. It's it called like cooking. Are you sure? Yeah. It's called cooking with Mo. Yeah. I put the what name. Put the name. She told me to name it. Like. Are you serious? As always, guys, I'm gonna wrap up today's vlog here. I love you all. By the way, last time I'm telling you this because tomorrow I'm gonna announce the giveaway winners to the camera and the GoPro. Also, let me know what else you want me to give away next. The only rule for this giveaway, as I've mentioned for the past couple of weeks, is to be subscribed. This is the last time you can do it before me announcing the winner. So tomorrow I'm going to pick a random subscriber or two random subscribers to give these cameras to. Anyways, stay awesome. Love you all. Don't forget to subscribe if you want to be in. Don't tell me. I didn't tell you the rules, guys. But yeah, love you all. Yalla yolo. Bye. Good luck, everybody. Good luck. Boom.